Alright guys, it's time for another episode of Dances with Hunters. <laughs> Whoo, man. These hunters, man, they get on my damn nerves. Alright, good luck. Yeah, alright. Um, okay, let's see. What are we gonna need here? Uh, I know there's some dogs crawling around. I'm also actually gonna bring the colt. And I'm gonna go down there like this. Yeah, we're gonna do this way. Uh, I know there's a couple dogs still hanging around in the courtyard. And there's still one hunter where you put the crests away. Plus there's... Shit. At least two down in the tunnels. I really wish the Magnum, the Colt Python, would take him down in one shot. Like it does in the other Resident Evils, but... Oh well. God damn it. Oh, you bastard. Alright, he's down, but we gotta go back and get a healing item, you fucking cocksucker. Thank you so much for that. Ugh, oh, pain in the ass. I can't bring uh, anything else besides what I've got. Because I'll need one more extra space. Perhaps I should have. Eh. Whatever, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Uh, yeah, we got a good amount of healing items. Go ahead and grab these. Heal up and continue on. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna drop the, uh... Shotgun shells. And we're gonna go down like this. Okay. These hunters, they're such dicks. Constantly getting in my damn way. Alright, well he's dead. Keep on going. Nothing in here. And now that we're back outside, we can hear these fucking dogs just howling at me. Signaling the hunter's victory, I suppose. Alright, drop down. Okay. Dodging snakes, bro. What's up, doggy -o? Oh, he got me. Ah, uh, one shot. He's still alive. Fuck. I don't wanna... God damn it. I'll do it. What a waste. Put the battery in. Uh, you know what I'll do? Maybe I'll just pop back in the guardhouse and use the item box in there. I'm trying to figure out what's a good amount of space to head down into the tunnels with. Yeah. Because if I go over to the guardhouse item box... I can drop the crank. 
since I'll use it right here and I won't need it again. That's a good idea. We'll do that. Still agree and fine? Yep. So we'll lower the gate damn thing. Opening up our path to the tunnels. And then we can take the elevator back down. Let's see, what are we taking down into the tunnels? Uh, we'll take the Colt. I guess we'll take the shotgun. Not gonna need the crank. We won't need a healing item. Okay. Alright, I've got a pretty good idea of what we're gonna do now. Head over here and reload. More than anything, that's, I just need some more ammo. Kill the dogs here, there's nothing. Alright. Hop in here. Okay, uh, so we'll pull out the magnum rounds, the shoddy shells, put away the square crank, let's see, ammo disc, eagle metal. Oh yeah, we're fine. Still got four healing items left. Plus there's a bunch of herbs, there's at least another two first aid sprays. I'll put the magnum rounds away. And we'll go in like this. This will be more than enough. There is some herbs down that hall, but we won't need them. We're fine. Okay. Time to head into the tunnels, bro! Where there's hunters and spiders and all sorts of fucked up shit. Alright. Dropping down this ladder. Here we go. Uh, we don't need to go that way, so we'll head over here. And here's a big difference from Chris and Jill's games. Chris gets the flamethrower. But it acts more as a puzzle similar to the shotgun. Go ahead and check it out. Can throw flame for 9 seconds with max fuel. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and equip that. Why not, right? Um, it, it's okay. There's much better items, like the Colt Python is way stronger. But this will get the job done for the Black Tiger boss. Okay, so we'll take the shoddy shells. By putting the crank down, we can take this uh, first aid spray. Because we'll still need one open space to pick up the hexagonal crank. Uh, going through here. Yep. Say hello to the homeboy over here. Enrico! Don't come any closer, Chris. Wait, what happened? Double crosser! Don't! Uh, hell. Umbrella. Who is it? I is someone there? Double crosser? What did he mean by that? I don't know, Chris. What the fuck could he have been talking about? Couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. 
Hopefully it's not just a stupid fucking clip, it is. Oh joy, let me grab that clip. Fuck out of here. Um, yep, yeah, so we got a friend here. What the hell? Alright, so he's down. But we got another hunter here. Asshole. Oh, that one shot at him, huh? Okay. Fortunately, we have to heal, but whatever. Um, okay, so we got the hexagonal crank. And we can go through this door. That was weird. It's like the hunter glitched through the flamethrower. Okay, you... Yeah, you get your one shot on me, but... Uh, have fun with that. I missed? Fucker. Not playing games anymore. It's magnum time. Okay, so we'll put the flamethrower down because uh, we have to to unlock this door. It's the puzzle aspect of it. And now that we have the hexagonal crank, we can go ahead and get through this passage up here. Its end is hex shaped. Why, thank you, Chris. Okay. Oh, went right by it. Now we'll let Chris just crank away. Oh, that noise. Hearing that for four more Resident Evil games. Eh, eh. Oh, finally done. Uh, okay. I'm trying to think, what's in the next room? Oh, yeah, right, right. So, we definitely want this. Now, our friend, the giant spider, is coming up. But, we don't have the bazookas, Chris. No flame rounds. So without flame rounds, we'll just have to make do with flamethrower. Uh, okay, I gotta get ready for this hunter right here. Come on. One shot, okay. That's strange. Sometimes it takes one shot, sometimes two shots. It's a little odd, but... You're not gonna hear me complaining. Um... Okay, so I guess I'm going to walk in here, pop him with a magnum rounds, and then we'll go to the flamethrower. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. Alright, so he misses. Put that. Do that. Oh, shit. Well, at least he took down some of that for me. Oh, no! Thank you, Chris. He's trying. There we go. Got him. Take the webs off with the flamethrower, and get the fuck out of here. Boy, all these guys are giving me a run for my money today. Um, <laughs> danger. We'll go ahead and throw the flamethrower on this little panel right here. Unlocking the door.
Um. Yeah, there's. Go ahead and equip the shoddy, I guess. Not gonna need the Colt Python anymore. Alright, well, there's a first aid spray. We'll go ahead and use that. And we will put away the Colt Python for now. Still got, what, 21 bullets? That's more than enough. Uh, let's get this stuff all sorted out a little better, too. Clip. Um, okay, so... Like that. Not bad. We'll be fine. Uh, yeah, this is all we're gonna need, too. Uh, actually, I'll take out the wolf metal. Er, eagle metal. Yep. No, there's no point in doing that. We'll just put it back, that back down. Okay. Bunch of snakes and shit. We're not concerned with them. And say hello to Mr. Boulder number two. Gotta use our hexagonal crank and get this hole on the left side, though. Spin faster, Chris, you fucking jackass. I know Chris is probably really regretting joining stars now, like... Oh, damn, maybe I should've went and been a dental assistant instead. Probably didn't expect to be running from fucking boulders, like... Indiana Jones. Alright, here we go. Looks like we have a map of the underground. And what's over here? An MO disc, right? Yep. Okay, giving us two of the three we need. And let's get the wolf metal, shall we? Uh, okay. So, push this down a little bit. And go ahead and use the hexagonal crank. And use it once more. Cool, cool. Now we'll just push this on top of the little pressure plate. Grab the Doom Book 2. And voila! There was a medal in the book. The motherfucking wolf medal. Okay, so we don't need a bunch of this shit. We'll go put it back, grab the Eagle Medal, and continue on to the laboratory. Uh, yeah, we're going through here. Oh, what's up, snakes? Okay, um, we'll put away this MO disc for now. Uh, we want to put away this crank, and we'll take the Eagle Metal. And we will grab this Ink Ribbon. And throw down a save before heading on to the lab. Alright guys, I'll see you next time as we go fuck up Umbrella's lab. Later.